940. English seems fine to me, Frap. English seem, seem totally fine to me. Ten years, three months, and ten days have gone by since they've been away. Where are they? You feel empty. Oh, wait, I forgot to mention. Oh, oh that's what I forgot to look at. Okay, hold on a second. The other games we played tonight. Um, pause, pausing the time. Um, future Punk themes. Hidden cheats and not what it seems. Okay. Seems like it hit it to me. Um, Melancholic Doll. Purple and Time Travel. Okay, we'll see about Time Travel in that one. And then... The Elka. We already... Damien's already hit it. Uh, time Travel, Hidden Cheats. Okay. Alright. Back to the game. Sorry. Oh, he's all bearded. The royal bed. You usually don't sleep. You, uh, you don't usually sleep on it. Bookshelves containing books. You don't remember any particular book, but recognize that they hold value. A book of poems. It's turned to a certain page. Do you want to read it? Oh yeah, it's April now. Uh, okay. Pause the game for a second. Pause, pause my time for a second as I take care of that real quick. I keep forgetting... Stream Labs, login, Twitch. The loved prince. Oh, prince, how loved you are. You have much to say, yet no one can hear you. People cry for you, yet you can't see. As you rise up higher and higher into the sky, you might cease to exist. Oh, prince, how loved you are. Locked for as long as you can remember. If only you could go out of this castle for one last time. Ooh. Big game. I got the idea. See what? Oh god, my Yumi goes trash. Put on the ground to a certain page. Would you like to take a look at it? Yes. This picture brings back some fond memories. Back when they were still around. It's like a neo thread and some onions. A grandfather clock. You usually spend most of your time staring at it, waiting for them to come back. What would you like to do? Well, we'll save real quick. Stare. You keep thinking about that picture from the book. If only there's a way for you to come back to a time when they were here concentrate Whoa. what what zero years zero months and one day since they've been away you feel energetic and curious a rocking horse is too tall for you to get on it a chest what's inside is not certain but it's probably filled with toys a painted wooden block. Would you like to take one? You got a wooden block. Take some. You got a, three wooden blocks. A block and a wooden block. The royal crib. Bookshelves containing books. At this height, you can only grab books at the bottom shelf. Yes, you grab a book in the bottom shelf. You can make out the words medical and report. A baby changing station. You're never going to need it. A plastic plant. The door is still locked. They have the only key out of here. Oh, young pr Nightly, no! <laughs> I 
I love that the bus is the POV of the baby. I didn't realize you were awake. Were you perhaps scared that I wasn't with you? Sorry, the madame downstairs has been taking a lot of my time. Don't worry, I'll always be here with you despite them though. You can trust me on that. It must have been lonely when that... No, no, never mind me. I'll get back to my duties. <sighs> it's what the baby... I love that. That's great. I'll be setting up the station for you, so please wait a while before you become impatient. We're all doing the best we can to attend to you and our duties as much as possible. After that, we can stay with you for as long as you need. Would that make you happy? Okay, I'll give you read a book from that bookshelf if you want. I hope that you are happy. Just or else. I feel anxious about. Oh, young prince, is there anything you need from me? Is it a story? Oh, this book seems like it would be too big for me to read. Well, I'll never get to finish it before the madame calls me downstairs. Calls me. Well, that's okay. For like I said, I I'm okay with it personally, but. I have no idea if it'll if it'll get falsely flagged. Because that's the other thing. It could, it could get falsely flagged. Because it sounds similar to the to another song, you know? Like, I could have the beat from, you know, Michael Jackson's Beat It. And I could be singing my own version or whatever. Or I could be playing the music and playing. But if it sounds too similar, the DMC it just doesn't give a fuck. Which is stupid. Because it's not actual people. You know, it's just a system. It's just a robotic system. Anyway. No worries. I personally am fine with it. I'll tell you a story of my own. Madame downstairs has told me something interesting about you when I was down there. Apparently you would somehow always get out of your crib and crawl around in your room, which I suppose is what you're doing right now. One time, you accidentally face planted onto the ground when you were getting out of the crib. I don't know if you remember that, as I was not here to see it, but you worried the Madame downstairs greatly. It wouldn't be the last time that you would fall and make her worry. I just wish I saw her reaction before she became... Oh, I shouldn't say it. You mustn't worry yourself about that. Wherever you are, wherever you might be in the future, you'll surely become happy, right? Yes, it is right, Zane. <laughs> it's pretty nice to talk about mundane stories like this, wouldn't you say? It makes moving on with life that much easier. Oh, the madame downstairs is calling for me again. Sorry, but I must take my leave. It was nice seeing you. I ought to prepare this for some other time. Is loud. You feel, you feel empty as they had left you again. You'll turn outside if I kiss a little bit. A baby changes it. You're never gonna need it. There's something on it, but you can't reach it due to your height. Maybe if there's a structure you can stand on, you'd be able to reach it. Aha! You got a key. <gasps> well, you had a key. It'll come when it hits a certain place. We're gonna save, and we're gonna go exploring a used crib, a lifeless mannequin, an urn. You can't see what's in it. A coffin. Whoa! What the? You don't know why though. One collectible found. There are three in total. Whoa. Speed, baby! Stare. The hands haven't moved this whole time. What would you like to do? We're back, baby! And I got a key! Actually, item. Oh, I can't use the book, okay. Hello? Oh, how are you? I haven't seen you since... Oh, wait. You don't want to talk about that, huh? Sorry for almost bringing that up, I... 
Anyways, what are you doing right now? You don't want to talk about it? Oh, okay. It must have been real rough on you, huh? Don't worry. It's not your fault, though. It should be me that you blame. You should blame, not yourself. I... No, let's drop this subject. They wouldn't want us to worry about them. If you want to know what I'm doing... I'm actually working on a little project. Over the past few years, I've been wanting to start something, but I never got the motivation. But ever since that, I suddenly got the motivation to make something for once. I haven't been visiting them recently, but I want to finish this before they see me. They're always looking forward to my future endeavors, though, so I thought I would give them something one last time. Hopefully they like it. Ooh. Classic plant. Books of various subjects. Would you like to read a book? Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown, and Jill came tumbling after. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? With silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great ball. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. All work and no play. We lodged the plastic plant. Ooh, you got an umbrella. All right. I'm here. You aren't able to see a reflection in it, though. To the main room library, throne room, and garden. Hey, Dragon Claw, how you doing? A nice statue with a sword. Yes, you got a sword. A plastic plant. I hope it will, or it will ever or will ever be open again. Oranges and lemons say the bells of St. Clements. You owe me five fatherings, says the bells of St. Martin's Farthings. When will you play, pay me, say the bells of Old Bailey. When I grow rich, say the bells of Shoreditch. And when will that be, say the bells of Stephanie? Oh, I do not know, say the bells, say the great bells of Beau. Here comes a candle to light you to bed, and here comes a chopper to chop off your head. Oh. Ring a ring of rosies, a pocket full of posies, a tissue, a tissue, we all fall down. That's wrong! Ring around the rosies, pocket full of posies, ashes, ashes, we all fall down. This is how I learned it when I was a kid. A chair, you don't feel like sitting down. Here's the library. For some reason you have an uneasy feeling about this room. You can't exactly remember why. Without them, this room feels incomplete. They could be in here waiting though. Okay, free music, okay. Books of various subjects. Most of the titles are illegible from old age, so you can't read them. It's a time to go through time! <sighs> yeah, save. And stare. Any attachment to this room? What'd you like to do? Concentrate. No, 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 no. I am gonna be playing them over the next couple of uh, days, certainly. If, if they're each 30 minutes long, at the minimum, it'll be 26 and a half hours. At least. Well, we're actually 26 and a half hours at the most. I'm sorry. Sorry. So if they're all 30 minutes, but we've been playing some that we've gotten done shorter, so. Three years, four months, and five days have gone by since they've been away. You feel bored or lost in thought. Oh, door's open. Where's the prince at? They're missing their lesson. And this is how he sees them. It's just a big brain in a hat. There you are. Do you know how long I've been looking for you? What are you even doing? I don't have time to... Oh... Are you still thinking about that? Yeah, man, yeah. I see. In that case, I can excuse you from trying to ditch. But you still need to come to your lessons. Follow me. You've already wasted enough time, enough of my time, as I've, as I've 
as I've already had, as I've had already. Good lord, I can't read. You're not filled with curiosity and interest. Chris, you're finally here. Once you get yourself situated near that desk, we can begin the lessons. Are you finally ready, Prince? If so, let's begin. Though we don't do this often, there's something I want to hear you to hear about. Poetry! Oh, yeah. You see, poetry can be used to express different kinds of emotions and feelings, whether by themselves or towards another subject. There are many depths and layers that can be included with poetry, but since I'm short on time, I don't want to prolong this lesson. Just right now, I'll be looking at one specific kind of poetry made by various artists. Let's wait that way. Some may call all these types of poems ju juvenile, but for you, I think they suit you well. If you were to grow up, that would inevitably change, but uh, I'm getting too ahead of myself. Anywho, nursery rhymes are often based on different events that went on in history, or things people observe in everyday life. For you to get the hang of them, I want you to go through the library books to look for topics that fascinate you. You'll be using these topics in order to create your own poem about yourself. Not a healthy way. Come back once you have enough, have a rough idea for what you want to base your poem on. With this poem, I want you to express yourself as a person, no matter whatever you are, wherever you are, so your memories won't be forgotten. Okay, time to become a poem. Picture of a grand blue lake with a boat laying atop. People seem to be on the boat enjoying themselves. Looking at the picture makes me feel reminiscent. Let's see your selections. Okay, so we have a boat picture. Absurd of an essay about the dangers of some word you don't know about. Asphyxia. Asphyxia. For you, that word doesn't didn't sound pleasant. Do I ask selections? No. The page is selected to a picture of a lone light purple flower in a meadow with just a stone to accompany it. There's a caption underneath the picture. A lily just as sweet would be would just result in misery. Selections? No. Oh, okay. I thought you just picked a couple. Ah. Alright, here we go. Books are very subject. The pages appear with facts about different kinds of fish in the deepest parts of the ocean. There's pictures included with the page. Most of the pictures depict the fish with grotesque faces and unimaginable, propor unimaginable proportions. You feel yourself immersed within these pages, not wanting to look away from them. Now this here selections? Yes. It's best to head back. Okay, there we go. Oops. Prince, it seems you have returned. <clears throat> Shall we start working on your poem? Come to me when you want to write your poem. Okay, in order to make a, a memorable poem, you will need a certain structure that flows with a certain cadence. However, I'll be honest with you. I'm not actually experienced in writing things like this. Don't you dare try to discredit me, though. Just because I'm not experienced, it doesn't mean I can't try. I'm sure you make an okay poem. Go back to your desk in order to get, to get started. Remember, most poems include the writer's feelings and emotions about a certain topic. Ugh, I used to write angsty poetry. Never again. Lake. The coolness of the water brushes against your skin little by little. What's the second topic? Ooh, um... The lily. You become overwhelmed by misery, as though it were a flower's fragrance. Is there a topic? The fish. Soon the fish will become attracted to the scent. Last topic? The mixer. As you could do nothing else but take your last breath. Are you finished with your poem? Let's see how progress is coming. Wait, are, are these feelings about that? I didn't take into account the pain I... Oh... Oh no, oh no, 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 no! Whoa. Where did they go? What happened to them? Did they leave you behind? You feel empty. Bookmark. It smells faintly of lilies. Yes, got a bookmark. Familiar hat. familiar tie. Well, 
Oh, is it, are there no are there no collectibles? Dang. Unless no, that was one of them. Just the notebook. Okay. Menu. to present time. What you like to do? Stare. Care Bear, stare. Ticks and talks echo throughout your mind as you try to rationalize where they could have gone. What you like to do? Concentrate. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Do not have to see me again. So you won't reveal your true feelings to me. Because there might be a note attached to the page. I can make other names, other letters E, L, O, Y. The rest of the letters are smudged off. I want to bring the book with you, but if you do, you're going to lose the page when you close the book. I wonder there's a way for you not to lose the page. A lifeless mannequin. Oh. The heart, the brain. Okay. It's a collectible, boom. Hello? Can I talk to you about something? It's about that. I know it was an accident, but but I can't feel as if it were my fault. I, I was the one who told them to... <sighs> if only I had known it would come to this, I shouldn't even have started writing these damn poems. Do they even enjoy them that much? Why did I tell them to follow me and look for inspiration and... Sorry about that. I've calmed down now. H however... Uh, however... Uh, however... Who am I kidding? I shouldn't be talking to you about this, or anyone else for that matter. I'm just a worthless piece of trash who doesn't deserve to visit them anymore based on the things I've done. I can't bring myself to think that they'll forgive me after all this time. When you visit them next time, could you read this aloud to them? Eulogy. Eulogy. Oh god. Think of it as my reparations towards them. It's eulogy. the door. Sword. Friendly out, but you can't see them anywhere. I don't think I'm supposed to leave yet. Yeah, but you somehow feel melancholic. Could they be in here? I'm gonna save. Despite not knowing anything about the room, the ticking of the clock reminds you of something. Concentrate. Eight years, five months, and two days have gone by since they've been away. You feel anxious and lost. Oh, you're finally back. I didn't realize you would be coming back, but I'm happy that we could each see each other again. Do you still remember me? It's okay if you don't remember, but I'd be grateful if you did. I see. Well, I should probably leave you alone then and let you carry on with your duties. I wouldn't want to become a bother to you, especially after what happened. After that happened. For some reason you want to follow them, despite them already left the room. Okay, press the to sit on. Oh, you followed me. I didn't really expect you to, but what can I do now? I want to ask you again. Do you really not remember me? I know we haven't seen each other in a while, but... Sorry, I'm overstaying my welcome. If you want nothing to do with me, it's fine. I'm, I'm okay with it. But I want you to guess my name this one time. 
After not here, after not, and no, time, and after not again. Uh, Lily. I see. Do you really think that's sadly of me? Well, I guess it can't be helped, to be honest. I wish we got to know each other better. better. It's too late now, I suppose, now that you... <clears throat> Even though I've known you for so long, I should introduce, introduce myself. I'm... Oh, the music book is playing again after all this time. You know, when we were together, we used to dance to the tune of the song, through, uh, though it's all in the past now. I wish I could have spent more time with you. It's truly unfair how life can be sometimes. I'm sorry, but can you fulfill one of my requests? I want to dance with you. And who knows, maybe you'll find something, maybe you'll finally remember something. Let's set up the mood first. I heard that some flowers give off some strong emotions to those who want to feel them. Feelings of escapism. Do you want to set the mood with these feelings? Sorry, do I set with these feelings? No. Flowering plant. Oh, it's only those two. Well, I'm gonna go with escapism. I've already had enough sorrow. Oh, this mood. I'm disappointed you feel this way, but shall we dance? Oh, no! I made the wrong choice! I think because I think he's moving a little too fast. That's the time is a lot, but you know it's okay. That was a nice dance, wasn't it? it? Made me wish we could go on for longer. Such is the melancholy of life, though. I guess all good things must end, even if you don't remember them. I wish you would have remembered me. The limited time we spent just now really lifted my up my spirits. This is goodbye. I hope we get to see each other again, possibly in another life or in the after. They vanish into thin air. Where did they disappear to? You feel empty. No longer play this melody. Feelings of escapism. Well, I'm gonna save. Stare. It's the Care Bear. Stare. Concentrate. Here we go. A lifeless mannequin. Coffin radiates a foreboding, a foreboding hour aura. Do you want to open it? Kill your flower. You can't smell any aroma from it. Okay, we got three. Is this... Oh, hello there. How have you been? I haven't exactly keeping in touch after being away for so long. Did, did they really... I didn't expect this to happen. How did they... Actually, I changed my mind. I don't think I want to know. Ignorance is bliss and all, or whatever they say. Sorry, that was really insensitive of me, but still, it's shocking how when they went away, they would just... I should try to get to know them better. If I'd done that, could we have had a better start to our relationship? Probably not, but... It's really too late now, isn't it? If we did have that relationship, though, could they have been there with us for longer? That's highly unlikely, but I still wish that we could have been with each other more. Do they even remember me? It's been so long that I, that I last saw them. Well, I suppose that's enough for me. I doubt they'll want me back anytime soon. The next time you visit them, could you give this to them, though? Say it's a souvenir I promised them, but I only know, but I only now just got it. This is goodbye, then. I think it's good right now if we get to have some space for each other and wait for a better time to meet up.
It appears to be raining on the statue. At this rate, the statue is going to rust. Once you've explored the entirety of here, you're allowed to ascend and move on. If you're ready to move on, hopefully you'll have a safer trip than the last time. Have no regrets. The boat bounces up and down as the waves crash upon it. Do you want to ride it? The waves bash against your boat as you try to manage your balance. Though the water seemed calm before, it feels hard to navigate through. The feel of the water and the air combine in a harmonious manner as you struggle more and more every second. You tried all you can to remain on the boat, but... You somehow landed on an island. This seems like it's the only piece of land that's accessible. A fish struggling. A pillar. It appears you can put something on it. Thread. Book. Kill your flower. A talus is in front of the gate. Those who have no regrets and nothing left behind shall come onto this promised land. All those who have burdens weighing them down shall sink to the depths of the water to never see the shine of light again. What's he gonna say? What do you want to do? You haven't seen them in your present time yet. Are you sure you want to go inside the gate instead of waiting for them? Yes. Mm. Farewell, everyone. I hope we'll meet again someday. It was nice knowing you for all the limited time I had. Don't worry about me. I'll be in a better place by now. I've decided to move to a new location to wait for you all to arrive. Until you can reach me, please take care of yourselves. You all mean a lot to me. I have hydrated myself. Poignant. Do that have to do with Alzheimer's? If you don't collect collectibles. I gathered. Went a couple minutes over, but that's okay because I did take a little bit of extra time doing other stuff, so that's why. But you know that? Very melancholic. Okay, who else is here right now? KV, are you still here, KV? A royal success. Okay, so we got that. We can close that now. Human, he left for the night. That's Chibis. Okay, we already played that one. And then Future Punk, we already played that one. Okay. Let's play a KV's game. We'll start with the, the game that he did by himself. Let's do it. Oh, is it just on... Okay, so it's just on the website. But Oh, download. Okay. I prefer to download it. Dungeon Clicker. A mother's slime babies have been kidnapped by a monster, and it's up to you to rescue them. Click your way through multiple waves of enemies, fight the boss, and rescue the baby slimes. Hmm, okay. Cool. Let's go with Dungeon Clicker. Let me delete that first. Here we go. Oh, human. Okay. I want to play yours when you can watch. Brian painted you. Alright, options. Turn it down just a little bit. I saw him. Prepare to meet your doom. Whoa, wait. I don't want to fight you. Why not? Oh, whoa. The monster attacked me and took my babies. They are trapped in that cave. And you are a monster. Hey, we're not allowed to kill everyone. So are you going to help me or are you just going to let some innocent slime babies become dinner? Ronald, 
fine. There'll probably be a more interesting battle anyway. Okay, next. A monster ambushed you. <laughs> you win. Next level. Next level. It's going to be harder to kill with your sword. Let's see, you have fire magic. There we go. Switch back to your sword at the beginning of each encounter, okay? Oh, you gotta go fast. Ah, oh, jeez. Boss, ah. You win! My babies are back, thank you! In all my years, I never thought I would be thanked by a slime. It's the first time for everything. Want to stay for dinner? Uh, no, I, uh, have a mission to kill, um, monsters. How exciting! What kind of monsters? Hmm? No. No, okay, I was about to say, oh no, not the babies! Okay, well, that was that was pretty fast. <laughs> uh, okay, alternate ending with the uh, mama slime win. <laughs> that took a dark turn. <laughs> okay. Here's the other one. Okay, so here's the other one. Time ninja. Just gotta download because it it's just easier for me than playing it on my browser. To be perfectly honest. All right, have a good night, human. Um, I'm sorry I didn't get to get. To, I didn't realize you would come back. Shoot, I'm sorry. I would have played your game. I might be streaming tomorrow just to give you a heads up. And if you show up tomorrow, if I do stream, then I will definitely play your game. So you have a good night, human. Ninja. Awesome. Okay. Why, why do I hit Pokemon? What are you talking about, Cloud? Time Ninja. Here we go. Okay, then this one. Oh, wait. Um, shit, I didn't even look at the... This one says Purple Baby's Dungeon Crawler. Okay, fair enough. That seemed to hit all the notes right there. And then Time Ninja, what does that say? Time Travel, Purple, Silent Protagonist. Okay. Let's see what we got here with Time Ninja. But what I don't I don't know what you're talking about. Why would I hate any Pokemon fan game? Maybe a few more minutes. Turn it down just a little bit. Okay, time, ninja. Times are changing. How do you want mission briefings and cutscenes to present, be presented? Oh, audio and text? Yeah, sure. 150 years. 150 years the purple have been fighting against the green. For 150 years, the battle has continued. Oh my. But I, Dr. Percival Caldor, have found the solution. For over here, my life's work, a time machine. You can look into it and see any time <laughs> to the past. Yes, Cloud, it's exactly that. Human versus furry, finally. Take down all those furry bastards. I have seen the event which caused this war. I can never hope to get back in time. <laughs> no! Myself. While my intelligence is staggering, my physical prowess is quite lacking. <laughs> my intelligence is staggering. So I've contracted an agent to help me, to assist me in stopping this 150 years of battles, of wars, of deaths between the purple and the green.
Bear, Green River Valley, once home to our most prominent citizen, including our then president, Bartholomew Thurgood. Back then, the dam held back the mighty Green River, but our enemies had different plans. They blew up the dam, releasing the raging river and killing the inhabitants below. The heinous act sparked the war between purple and green. You have been tasked with stopping this from happening. There is a bomb that sits on the top of the dam. Make your way to it and disarm it. Dispatch anyone who gets in your way. You may find it easier if you cut the power to the dam. There's a turbine room located underneath the dam. Countless lives, oh, both green and purple, are counting on you. Good luck and Godspeed. Godspeed. Go, you magnificent time bastard, go. Okay. Use your environment to remove the guards, or go below and shut down the power. Um. Whoa. Be careful. You are surrounded by mines. One touch and our mission will be lost. The, the arch. <laughs> I love it. Oh God, it's like TMNT. Oh God, it is. It's this. It's this. It's the damn level of TMNT, isn't it? Oh no, emergency set down. One, three, two. Okay. That's what you're One, two, three. The power has Those been PJs. shut off. Your night vision will allow you to see in the dark, while the green party will be in the dark, so to speak. Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! Back through the minefield. Yes, quiet. Aha. Oh, so I just... What? What? How do I... Oh. <laughs> oh. Ninja. <laughs> oh my god, I garroted him! What? Two, one, three, two. Okay, two, one, three, two. Okay. Wow. Bomb deactivated. What? It's a frog! Did it work? Something is amiss. The dam's destruction has been averted, but the timeline still remains intact. <laughs> I have pinpointed to a new incident. President Thurgood is assassinated by an unknown assailant. Reports <laughs> claim the assailant gained access to the Purple Party headquarters through a rooftop elevator. Okay, have a good night, human. See you later, ma'am. Find the assailant and stop him. Anyone you run into will be armed, so you will need some weaponry as well. I have oh. outfitted you with several ninja weapons. <laughs> the fate of the world rests in your hands. Ninja weapons. Be careful and good luck. Good luck. Here we are. To the future. Again. Tune of the creator of the movie. Oh, God. What the... <laughs> Time ninja blowgun throwing knife shuriken. Okay, appears thicker skin or hit small targets, small slim targets. 
Okay, I think we have to use that throwing out of a, a turtle in force. Okay, there we go. I have to use the right weapon for the right thing. I <laughs> just yeet myself off a building. Okay, um, blowgun, perfect for small, slim targets. If you're thick skin or hits, yeah, that one, we want the frog. Ha-ha! <laughs> Look at the little dance! This could be useful. Aha! Terror aboard the Hermes. I remember that game. Locked. Ah, that's what we needed, the rope. The purple choice. Real like the purple... <laughs> purple party and... What the hell? <laughs> okay, um... There we go. Blowgun. You'll be given a directional prompt. Hold down the correct directional button on the keyboard in time to battle the assassin. Oh god, I should have fucking saved. Oh god. Okay. Wow. Holy shit. I hit it. Oh, I have to hold it. I wasn't holding it. It's my bad. <laughs> These are great. <gasps> I see it too. It looks like the Green Party has also mastered time travel. This explains a lot. You better come back to the lab. Also a time assassin. I cannot believe it. The Green Party has mastered time travel. This explains how they continuously seem to be keeping the timeline intact. What's the messenger? Through my research, I have found the new spark of the war between... Oh, wait, is that that one, um, 8-bit type game? President Thurgood is killed by a car bomb on his way to a rally. You must oh, intercept no. this car bomb and dispose of it in a safe place. Oh, there me. is a lake to the south of the location I am sending you that will be perfect place to safely dispose of the car bomb. <laughs> Purple Steal lake. Steal the car and dispose of it. Millions are counting on you. You must not fail. You were cut. Oh, okay, I see. I have to stay completely out of their line of sight. Okay. That's not gonna work. Huh. What? Oh, I just say, okay, far enough away. Okay. Drive! Oh, they're, oh, they're chasing me. Oh no! I crashed. Shit. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god, they're all coming for me. Oh god, they want my butt. No! I was right there! That was bullshit! Okay, you can drive slow, okay. Oh, no, 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 out of the way. Ah, oh, that sucked. 
Home free. <laughs> As you jump out. <laughs> You've lost your return pad during the crash. You must retrieve it. Without it, you will be stuck in this time period forever. Just have to avoid. Everybody. I'm guessing, yeah. Oh, I'm just out in the open. <laughs> How you doing? Oh, I'm doing good. How are you? How do I? Oh, okay. Time to go home. No, water battle. Okay, okay. Um, we're start your opponent with a furious combo, lake toss. Will lower enemy defense. Water kick across the lake. Very fast move. Tumble in the water. Chance of slowing down the enemy. Okay, let's lower his defense. He just... Oh, he just floats across the water. One, two, three. Make roll, and then we'll heal. Zen flip, leap frog. Ah! Drop kick. Oh shit. Oh fuck me. Come on. Ah. Uh, that sucked. I gotta slow him. That's the thing. There we go. What? Oh, I'm dead again. Why are you supposed to be slowed? God damn it. Oh, good. Okay. We're okay. So drop kick his ass across the lake. Ribbit. I'm not taking any chances now. Have a tumble in the water. I get him. He got away, but no matter. Your return pad is safe. Ribbit. Come back to the lab. Despite your best effort, the war still rages on. The Green Party seems dead set on allowing it to continue. They must be stopped at, at all, all costs. costs. The current catalyst of the war is the poisoning of President Thurgood at a diplomatic banquet. I have been able to locate the precise location of the poison and identify the assassin. Oh. I am sending you to Purple Plaza Hotel. You must locate the poison and switch it with this vial of colored water. Hopefully, this will be the Green Party's last attempt to keep the timeline intact. This war must end and you are our only hope.
We have little time, so I will perform a scan. Oh shit. Pencil. It's a lamp. Pencil, okay. Small magnet. Drain. Oh, jeez. Got a string. What? We have a spindle. Let's need a combination to open a safe. It's a lamp. Welcome to the fucking show. Okay. It's hard to read. You need more light. Okay. Found the key. 8462. Uh, who, who, gave me, who gave me raid or, or host or whatever? Thank you, whoever that was. Quizzical. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's require a key. Unlock the key. Switch out the poison vial colored water. Yes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my. I will have to manually lock on his position. If I fail, the Time Ninja will die. No! Oh, oh God! Oh, phew. Whew! <laughs> we may have finally had a breakthrough. Directly following your most recent excursion into time, the Green Party believes you're dead, and they also believe their assassination attempt was finally successful. <laughs> we can use this to our advantage. I am sending you back mere minutes <laughs> after you were <clears throat> forcibly ejected from the hotel. The assassin will be passing your location on the way back to the Green Party headquarters. <laughs> this is great. If you can stay out of sight, you can tail him and discover where the headquarters are located. This will not only give you a chance to confront the assassin, but also destroy their time machine. This will be our greatest chance of success. You must not fail. Alright, here we go. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing. There's a purple note. There he is. Remember, stay out of sight. Use objects around you for cover. Follow him to his hideout and dispatch of him before he is able to use the time machine again. This is our best chance at stopping the war. <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> Time to go. To work. Okay, so we can go down there. Wait, where do I go? Or do I climb up on the pipes? Yep. Cause I'm a ninja. Cowbunga. <laughs> look at look at him <laughs> look at his little hole his little swaying butt <laughs> it was adorable what the ah oh, I gotta start over wiggle wiggle exactly wiggle wiggle take a look at like when did I start this one 1019 I think so I got like another nine minutes before we hit the timer or so. I think it's okay. We're almost done anyway, so I think it'll be okay. Run from whatever the fuck that is. Green rules. Tell me I start after that point. Okay, good. Stay away from the holes in the wall. Good to know. That was a giant ass rat. Good lord. 
Oh god, there's two of them. Oh god! Oh! You have to zigzag. <laughs> Thank you, Professor. Son of a biscuit. Ah, zigzag, yeah. Yeah, fuck you, rats. Okay. Oh, it's timed, okay. Mm hmm? <gasps> it's the final showdown! Right. The time has come. You must defeat the assassin and destroy the time machine. You will not fail. Oh, shit. Yes. <laughs> it's actually hitting one of the highlighted areas before he gets back up. Highlighted areas? Oh. Time to fight again. This is pretty clever, actually. We've done it! And electrocuted him to boot. One hundred and fifty ah! years. One hundred and fifty years. Look at this. <laughs> One hundred and fifty years of brotherhood. Oh, that dude just. One hundred and fifty years with no fighting. Got just talking to a fucking and snake, and she's gonna get some turtle dick. That's great. <laughs> the time ninja has succeeded. And all is well. <laughs> oh, Mars. Hey, Boo Boo. How you doing, man? How you doing? Nova Kane and KB Kingdom. All right. Dude, I'm playing like Game Jam games, actually. In our game. The end. Alright, that was Time Ninja. Excellent. Okay, let's see here. Um, I think we got time. Let's do one more. This is humans. He's not here right now. Chibi. Um, she's not here right now, obviously. I mean Boo Boo. Hey Boo Boo, how long's your game? Yeah, all right. Let's finish out the night on Boo Boo's game then. Since Boo Boo just showed up. Fate of two worlds. All right, here we go. Okay, so I can keep track of the games that I'm actually playing and have played so I can rate them properly. All right, here we go. Fate of Two Worlds. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Warning, this game contains flashing screens. If you are sensitive to this, don't continue and exit the game. Time, 12 o'clock. November 29th, 2033. Lena Nuclear Power Plant. It's actually been a very boring post. Or should I say a very safe posting for me. Can't wait to be sent home tomorrow. What the? H honey, what was that? You go left and you go right. The rest of you with me and the commander. We're heading to the reactor. It must be destroyed at all costs. 
Car Prime breach detected. All available security personnel to Sector 09. Crap, gotta go. Duty calls. Well, we'll talk more with you later. Love you, bye. Die, Fed! No, this is the TP class, and the only way to get TP is to use the reload skill in battle, which will cost you a turn and give you 30 TP, or you can simply use the skill, the skill outside of battle. Oh, okay. Combat arts. Spray and pray. Oh, shit. <laughs> Health magic are fully restored. Okay. Reload. We're starting good now. He's still alive! That spray and pray is great. Like, holy shit. Is he like video? Oh my god. Suppressive fire! <laughs> Freight funeral voice. Security control room. I mean, I need security the control room. Intruders are banging at the door. I'm so sick guys have reached the control center. I better hurry. Oh shit. How do I get there? What? How do I? What? Oh, shit. Oh, we'll go off. Oh, shit. Again, Thanos snapped. Cloud. I missed? Shit! Oh shit, 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 shit. I have. Fuck. Fuck! Because I got lost! Oh, fuck me. Nope, I didn't get it. That's kind of annoying, actually. Where's my family? Are they okay? Brave soul who fears not death. I have an important task for you. Oh, you were never supposed to make it, were you? It would be heroes who desperately need your help. I need you to help them save their world. If you could do this, I'll turn back the clock and place you minutes before the bomb goes off so you can save your world. I wish for a success, brave soul. Now go. They need you. Ah, oh, crap. Get right here. Here's another Demon Lord's minions. Wait, those clothes and that weapon. He's not from our world. He must be the one that the prophecy Sister Eileen was talking about. Well, we're on to find out if you're right. Here comes an onslaught of the Demon Lord's minions. <laughs> As I just basically mow these fucks down. Okay, yeah. Boom. You made it all just yesterday? Good lord, man. There's a wave. If he runs that, we should be good. Oh, no. Boom. That sounds like, well, looks like you're right. This guy's on our side. Yeah, now let's finish this. <clears throat> The 
like it would be heroes have come to defeat me, it seems. Look at all around you. See all the corpses. What's he think you'd fare any better? Don't answer that. Now prepare to join them! Speed dev. Oh, that's an all, okay. Alright, here we go. Holy shit! <laughs> Boom! Headshot! <laughs> that was too much, man. I fucking... I fucking... One shot the Demon King! Oh god, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Miss, damn it. Mortals defeat me! Yes, we did! We won! Well done, brave soul. Now she'll send you back in time to just before the bomb goes off. Now save your world! But I thought we already cleared out this area! You and you with me! We gotta protect the commander, make sure this bomb goes off! <laughs> I got a friggin' crit on the demon lord, it's great. Miss, fuck. Okay. There we go, we got him. Give the commander. And so the reactor was saved, and the following day, a husband returned home to his wife and daughter. Oh, oh wow, that's it. Okay. I guess it came over. Bittersweet entertainment. Let's see if you're teaching me. Thanks for playing. That was a short one. <laughs> 